Hi, Nayla Moon here from Just the Stuff You Know and Reading Authors. And I have today again with me my husband, known as Tamrusk, and he is from Chronicles from the Man Cave, right? Mm. Don't start. Anyway, we were going to uh, do a vlogging video with the Mama Cat prompt for uh, TMI questions, but we couldn't find it, <laughs> find the questions. But we did find the Get to Know Me YouTube tag, so we decided we'd go ahead and do that one. Is that okay? Uh. Oh, and in case you're wondering why we're bundled up in our apartment, it's because we have no heat. That's right, no heat. And there's snow outside and it's like one degree, so we're freezing. So now you know, okay, so it's two degrees right now, but it will be one later, I know it will. Okay, so let's start, you ready? Uh huh. I can't, I can't, I've got the questions on my Kindle, but I can't, you know, scroll with my gloves gloves on, so I gotta take one glove off and have the other one. Okay. Yeah, she's doing the Michael Jackson look. Right. Okay, so what is your middle name? Which one? Your given middle name. Gerard. Oh, so that's what the G stands for. After six years I should know that. Yeah, you should. What's your middle name? <laughs> Do you know my middle name? I think it's Marie, isn't it? Ding, ding, ding! You win the prize! What's the prize? That's not a bad prize. Okay. Number two. Share your favorite subject in high school. Girls. Huh? Girls. <laughs> Good one. Mm -hmm. Um... I had a study boyfriend, so mine would have been I it, it wasn't a subject per se, but it was definitely I was the head photographer for two years for my school, so I was constantly in in the dark room. So I'd say the yearbook. Okay. Is that and, a subject? Yeah. Oh. Now seriously seriously, when I was in high school my favorite subject was drama. I wanted to be the next Richard Burton. Oh, okay. Cool. All right. Uh, what is your favorite drink? Tea. And coffee. Either yeah, or. Yeah. Well, mine is definitely Pepsi. I mean, it is the elixir of the gods, after all. <laughs> no, that's coffee. Pepsi. Coffee. Pepsi. Coffee. Next question. What is your favorite song at the moment? You go first. At the very moment? Um, you know, I don't, I don't really have a favorite song per se, but I guess since it's Christmas time right now, I'd, I'd have to say maybe I'm dreaming of a white Christmas. Well, there goes my answer. Um, what well, was it that yours? Yeah, that was well, yours, yours can be the same. Uh, one of my other favorite songs, and it sounds like I'm a much older person than I am, but the Glenn Miller classic, There'll Be Bluebirds Over the White Cliffs of Dover. Ooh, nice. Okay. Oh, I took my glasses off, and I forgot I can't see without them. <laughs> You and Admiral Kirk. Well, I was trying not to have glare, you know, but... Okay, well, anyway, I have to put them back on because I can't see. All right, so next question. Uh, huh. Number five, what would you or have you named your children? Well, that's easy. Since we don't have children together, um, but my children from previous marriages' names are Natasha and Joshua. And if I were to have, if I were ever to have children, I would name them Ralph and Evelyn. In honor. Ralph of and Evan. Evelyn. Evelyn, no. In honor of my parents. No. Yes. Okay. Number six. <laughs> have you participated in any sports? 
I can't talk about the sport I participated in. <laughs> it's not family friendly. <laughs> that is obnoxious. <laughs> Okay, I'll answer that one. Yes, I participated in volleyball and basketball when I was in grade school. Okay, moving on. <laughs> what is your favorite book? You can go first on that one. Let's see. There's the complete Sherlock Holmes. There is Dune. There is God Emperor of Dune. Uh, there is uh, the complete works of Mark Twain. In other words, I don't have a favorite. <laughs> I actually uh, do have a favorite, and mine is called Daddy Long Legs, and it is a favorite from when I was a child. And I lost the book along the way, but I found the book in this. Um, tiny bookstore in uh, Festus and shoot I would tell you what the bookstore is and dang if I can remember it right now do you know what it is? I can't even remember shoot. but I know the one she's talking about it's right across from the Festus library now too mm -hmm. so if you know if you guys happen to see this hi we miss being in your bookstore books galore? I think so I think that's it. I think so. I think it's Books Galore. So, hi from Colorado to Books Galore in Festus, Missouri. Love you guys. Anyway, okay, so what is your favorite color? Um, I like reds too, but pink's my favorite. Purple. Yeah. I like uh, blue and shades of brown and uh, green. I don't think I knew you liked green. I should have known you'd like green, though. You know, this is bugging me. Okay. Can I fix this for just a minute? Okay. <laughs> it was really bugging me. Okay. Um, number nine. What is your favorite animal? Meow. 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 Our cat's going to come running because you're doing that, you know. Okay, mine's a koala bear, believe it or not. I love koala bears. Uh, number 10, what is your favorite perfume? Mine would probably be Chanel number no. 5, but only because it, I like the smell of it, but more so I think it's because it reminds me of my mom. Mm. Yeah. Mine is Hey Karate! Axe? <laughs> no, High Karate. What's High Karate? It's a male perfume. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh, well, if you're talking about male cologne? Yeah. I love polo. Mm. I can smell polo from a mile away. Which I have a story about that, but we don't have enough time right now. So, okay, moving on. <laughs> uh, on a scale of 1 to 10, rate your childhood. Oh, jeez. Um... You want to go first on that one? I can, I I can say real easily. I think on a scale of one to ten, my childhood was probably a ten. I'd say mine was about a seven and a half, mm -hmm. with room for improvement. I understand. Mine mine was a ten, and I think it's because we lived out in the country and we just, you know, we didn't have technology then. Mm. Uh, you didn't either, really. You, but. Uh, well, I, I know TV. I played it. Well, we had a TV, but it was a family TV, and it was yeah. real small, black and white. Oh my gosh, are we dating ourselves? Yeah. Well, I had a, a black and white TV in my bedroom that was about. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So. You were essentially an only child, though, too. I mean, you had a, you have a brother, but he was he's, he's 16, sixteen years older than me. Yeah, he's yeah. sixteen years. He was pretty much gone while you were a child. So he, I can. After my fourth birthday, he was in California. Yeah. So. But, you know, for me, I i mean, I have three brothers and stuff, so, you know, it was, we always played outside, and mm -hmm. we had three acres of land, and we were always building forts and stuff like that. Green acres is the place to be. Okay, and it wasn't like that. Well, sort of. <laughs> <laughs> 
Have you been out of the country? I know you haven't. No, I have not. But I have. I've been, um, let's see, to Mexico and Canada. Uh, hello to my Canadian friends. And I have also been to Italy. Yes, you've been to Rome to see the Pope. Yes, and I really did see the Pope. Saw him twice. Mm -hmm. I said hi. He didn't hear me among the millions of people that were there, but I did see him. Mm -hmm. I know he noticed me. Of course. He gave that blessing thing. Of course. Okay. Right. <laughs> um, do you speak any different languages? Um, un poco. A little bit of Spanish, very, very, un poco, un poco, um, and I do, I do speak, or <laughs> I guess I don't speak it, but I have, I do uh, know sign language as well, but not real, real well. Das sprechen Sie Deutsch, mein Herr. Guten Tag, mein Herr. Das is first Tag, mein Herr. Yeah, I speak in the German a little. Un poco? <laughs> yes. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> See? Yes. Yes, well. And then we speak. Nela and Tamra speak, don't we? Yes. <laughs> yeah. and, occasion and occasionally I throw in a little Klingon just, yeah. to, just to scare people. Yeah. Bad. Bad. <laughs> okay, next question. Um. Do you have any siblings? Well, I just said that I have. We just talked about that. But again, I have three brothers. They're younger than me. Um, two of them are twins. So, uh, and uh, so Jason, Marcus, and Aaron. I have one brother, 16 years older than me. His name is Jeffrey Michael. And he lives in Orinda, California. And... And his phone number is <laughs> <laughs> no, but no, no we but, won't do but, that. <laughs> but, but, but Jeff is Jeff is sometimes uh, one of those people you want to disassociate yourself from. But there are times that I love him dearly. So it's one of those love hate relationships between us. But it's more love than hate. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Okay, um, number sixteen. What is your favorite store? <laughs> um, you know, I have to say Walmart, really. But also, I really, 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 really love thrift stores. Mm -hmm. And there's this thrift store right up there that we both love. Mm -hmm. And you can name that one. Yeah, that's Safari Thrift. Yeah. And yeah, we like Safari. I thrift. love it. I love it because of all the old records that they have and. I have been rebuilding my record collection like you wouldn't believe. Um, my, but my other favorite store is Colpar Hobbies, um, oh. ma mainly because I can spend a day there. I might not buy anything, but I can spend a day there just getting lost in all the model kits that they have, both on display and available in the shop. Um, it makes me realize how much I miss the old days of uh, hobby building because now you can buy one kit for fifty dollars, where you could walk out of the store in the old days for with five kits for fifty dollars. So, but my wife is oh. being annoying again. Okay. Um, well, we have to keep this at fifteen minutes. We're already at fourteen minutes, so let's move on. Uh, your favorite restaurant? It's uh, let's see. Uh, I like Pete's. Yeah, Pete's or Pete's Greek Restaurant. Pete's Greek or a place that used to exist called It's Greek to Me. Yeah. Okay, did you like school? Loved yes. it. Yes. Loved it. Uh, who is your favorite YouTubers? I'm not going to do favorites. Him. I'm not going to either because there's too long a list. She li he likes me. Okay, we'll just leave it at that. We don't, do, we don't want to do that. Uh, what is your favorite movie? Hands down, my favorite movie is It's a Wonderful Life. Favorite movie of all time? Casablanca and the original Star Wars. Okay. Uh, 
Oh my gosh, some of your favorite TV shows. Oh, we could be here all day. I'm just going to say MASH is one of my favorites. NCIS, Doctor Who, and... Doctor Who. Um, well, let's put it this way. The entire NCIS family, which there are now three series, and uh, Magnum P.I. Okay. Uh, PC or Mac, we have a laptop, so there you go. What phone do you have? I have this one. And Tamaris has one that looks like out of... Uh, Star Trek. Yeah. Dinosaur Ages. Um, and it, they're both from Cricket. So, uh, how tall are you? I am actually five... Well, I was 5'11", but apparently I've shrunk and now I'm 5'9". But sometimes they still say I'm 5'11". So, we'll go with 5'11". Five feet, four and a half inches and three quarters. And a partridge in a pear tree. Okay. Uh, do you have any pets? Meow. Yes. Meow. <laughs> yes, we do. Meow. And you've probably seen um, our cat Amelia in some of my videos where she just leaps across my video taking. So, anyway, that's the end of the questions, Tamaris. Okay. And so you get to know a little bit about me and my wonderful husband Tamaris and my wonderful wife Nayla Moon <laughs> so we hope that you enjoyed getting to know us and we will see you next time bye bye live long and prosper Pros prosper prosper whatever he hates that I can do that <laughs> bye <laughs> bye